to mark your designs is ready for dev, you come up to this toolbar up here. It's called region controls. You tap the drop down, you select section or shift S and you draw a box around your design just like that. And then you tap this little doobly do up here, it says mark ready for dev and it turns green. And that is it. That is your design marked ready for dev. It's literally just a way to highlight your design in what's probably a larger design file. You've probably had a conversation about this with your engineers and, and your developers. So it shouldn't come as a surprise to them. However, it's just a, a nice way to mark it in your, in your designs as uh, something that's uh, finished with design, quote unquote finished. Uh, you can make it a little bit neater like that. And then once you're ready and you have a, a paid team, this is my personal file, so you're not going to see that today. You could toggle that and mark the whole file ready for Dev2 where you can add annotations to your design decisions. You can uh, talk about like the reasoning behind some uh, spacing decisions um, and whatnot. Uh, so it's super useful. Not gonna lie, I would have thought this would have been a little bit easier to do. I I'd expect like a right click um, on the frame itself and then maybe something in this drop down here. Feels a bit messy for me personally. I like to have all my layers nice and neat. It feels a bit like a, a wasted nest to have it another step down, but hey ho, it's a, a minor, minor bugbear. But yeah, if this is something you're interested in, like and subscribe. If there's any other tips about marking things ready for dev, let me know. I'm all ears. Um, have a great day.